is at the front, Saki Katsu to Evans and Robin Perrett chasing down Ogier for one last stage, Julian Porter I mean we've seen a bit of everything this weekend but crucially, what a finale we've got ahead Yeah, I was just listening to that interview there with Kai I mean, he couldn't Now Frondo with his closest championship rivals to Milan Tanak Tanak would have to stop and change another puncture on Sun Saturday afternoon and when the rain finally came in Africa Final pass through Sleeping Warrior. The Estonian would slide his way to the finish line and have recovered. of Youth Affairs and Arts and Sports. And Oje and Vincent Landers, His Excellency William Ruto, President of the Republic of Kenya and Commander of the Kenyan Defense Force. Now, and it's time to celebrate!
WRC2. Kelele, a call for us to the top of All right, Eddie, as we ask her to come and get. All right, so in the non WRC years, uh, they won the Safari Rally five times and is also the chairman of the local organizing committee, Carl Tundo, along with Carl and Team Jessel. All right, ladies and gentlemen, in second place, it is uh, Martin Prokop, along with uh, Zdenek Yurka. Uh, to hand over the trophy, can I currently have... And it is of the winning driver, we will have the national anthem of France. To award the main big prize at AFP at Akimbia Kidogo. Well done. Marathon of a marathon seal. All right, Get your winner. <laughs> For the second time in three years, it is Sebastian Auger and Vincent Lande, the eight times world champion. Ladies and gentlemen, show a round of applause for the winner of the 2023 WRC Safari Rally. It is Sebastian Auger and Vincent Lande. As His Excellency poses with the uh, top three, ladies and gentlemen, show a round of applause for the top three of the 2023 uh, WRC Safari Rally. And congratulations once again, just 6.7 seconds, Eddie, the difference between... Do we have the rally crews here? Can you make some noise for the mechanics? All right, as they spray the champagne, congratulations. The champagne. This and is it. <laughs> congratulations, Werner Houghtonen and Sebastian Ocean and Vincent Lande. And of course, uh, the representative for Toyota, congratulations once again. Anti Corva as Toyota, of course, the winning manufacturer Look for the that. WRC Safari Rally. Absolutely fantastic. This is indeed a mark of history. 70 years of the WRC Safari Rally here in Kenya. And we uh, the winners of the well done. 2023 WRC Safari Rally. And the Toyota does not only include Yaris, Atakama open a pro box in So we have time world champion. Ladies and gentlemen, show a round of applause for the winner of the 2023 WRC Safari Rally. It is Sebastian Oje and Vincent Lande. <laughs> This is the moment we've all been waiting for. Congratulations once again to the three winners, Elvin Evans, Scott Martin, Callum Robert Merrill, Jonah Houghtonen, and Sebastian Ocean, and Vincent Lande, and of course uh, the representative for Toyota. Congratulations once again, Anthony Gorba, as Toyota, of course, the winning manufacturer. Look at that. The WRC Safari Rally, absolutely fantastic. This is the In the true sense of the word, this safari rally has been about everyone involved, from those enveloped by the dust, the hustlers who found space to earn a coin, the traffic managers, and those who came around for fun. I understand a phrase that has been doing rounds since Wednesday, which is Kosa Vasha Uchekwe. Miss Naivasha and become a laughing stock. In whatever capacity you came to Naivasha, we are grateful for your role in making this event a success. Nakuru County, Your Excellency, has a long history with Safari Rally, and I'm confident, and I can confidently declare that we are the home of this great sporting event. Today, Your Excellency, as we celebrate the 2023 WRC Safari Rally winners, allow me to congratulate our race ace, Carl Tundo, for representing the county of Nakuru in this race. We are proud that you, a son of our soil, and our gratitude also goes to the Kenyan drivers, and we cannot forget the women drivers and co-drivers who braved the dust, the heat, the terrain to complete the race. We are proud of all of you. We are happy that Kenya Motorsports um, Federation chose Nakuru to host this event. We have the hotels, the terrain, the centrality, a supportive county administration, and nature's given uh, for you to sample away from the Safari Rally. Your Excellency, I request that Naivasha Town be designated the home of Safari Rally racing in Kenya. 
Without a doubt, I'm confident that we have positioned Nakuru County as the one-stop destination of motorsports in Kenya, attracting both local and international tourists to explore a mix of attractions in sports, leisure, business, and investment. Ladies and gentlemen, I can only say that um, you've made us breathless. This is an epic moment. You have scaled the Rift Valley, and today the world will be asking the question, who can conquer the Rift Valley? We wait to see that happening again and again, and we look forward to seeing you again next year. I can say for me, the safari that is very nostalgic. Many years, long, long time ago, this was the only event that provided recreation in the village. We would wait the whole year for the Easter weekend. And when we see what is happening here, we recollect with nostalgia those great good days. To the great people who made this a success, we have in our midst the money people. I want to congratulate, first and foremost, the greatest sponsor to this event is the government of Kenya, followed by Kenya Commercial Bank to Wapigia Makofi. I saw the CEO somewhere. Thank you very much, Kenya Commercial Bank, for supporting this event. I am told Kenya Commercial Bank has put in 150 million shillings to support this event. Congratulations, Safaricom, our telco in Kenya. I saw Peter Ndegwa somewhere at the corner there to Wapigia Makofi Safaricom. I am told everybody stayed connected m was, was working, and the Hustler Fund was also working, and therefore there was no reason whatsoever to miss the money to come to this event. Also in our midst, we have Kenya Airways. I saw Kilabuka somewhere there. Wapige Makofi Kenya Airways, they supported this event with the tickets and many other, and many other issues. Asante Sana, Kenya Airways, to Wapige Makofi Tena. I don't know if I forgot anybody there. Yeah, those are the money people. And of course, Toyota. To begin my coffee, Toyota. Toyota, I think, got everything. They won all, everything here. I don't know how to, we are going to congratulate them. Congratulations, Toyota, for giving us the winning cars and for doing everything that is right. So, Asanteni Sana, thank you very much, the great people of Nakuru County. Continue to do the good that you are doing. We wish you well. God bless you. To the people who are the, our drivers, those who made it, congratulations. Those who won, congratulations. Those who participated, congratulations, including our women and everybody else. Asante Nisana, God bless you. I am very happy that after 19 years, Safari Rally came back in 2019. And today, we are here. Many Kenyans have had a wonderful weekend from Thursday through Friday. And I want to say to all the organizers, the sponsors, of course the rally drivers and their teams, and to everybody who made this event a success, congratulations very much on behalf of the government of Kenya to congratulate everybody who played a role in making sure that this comes to a successful conclusion. To the rally drivers, congratulations. Sebastian, congratulations for being the best. Congratulations. <laughs> Kale Ravanpera, congratulations. And your team. Evelyn Evans as number three, congratulations. In Rally 2, we have Kajetan Kajentawis as number one, Tumpigema Kofi. And we have Prokop as number two, and our own Carl Tundo as number three. 
by uh, I think counting the Kenyans, Carl Tundo became number one. Congratulations, Carl, for carrying our flag very high, and all the others who have participated in many ways. I want to congratulate Safari Rally, the World Rally Championships leadership. I want to congratulate our own team here in Kenya, and I want to say that the big conversation that is going on globally is a conversation about climate change. And we have seen the ravages of climate change from floods to cyclones to uh, drought and all of it. And I am happy that in this year's championships, this event led to the planting and the growing of 19 million trees as part of this event. I want to encourage the people of Kenya. We have taken it upon ourselves to plant 15 billion trees in the next 10 years because we want to make a difference in matters climate change in our country.